everybody. Uh, welcome. It's Thursday. A little cloudy out today, but it's not too bad. 63 out right now as I cross over the, uh, the Geist, Ridge, uh, Geist Reservoir Bridge. Um, just a couple quick notes. Center Grove Magazine will be hitting mailboxes. Uh, gets dropped in tomorrow, so on Friday. So look for those this weekend if you live on the south side. Uh, Dan and Jody have had uh, great response from people, so very positive response. People were kind of ready for a Center Grove magazine, and, and they are delivering it. It's a great issue this time. Um, interesting front cover story. I won't spill the beans yet, but it's just an interesting story about some of the history down on the south side. Um, Geist magazine is going to hit the first of next week. I think it's going to mail on Monday or Tuesday, so be looking for that. And then Carmel is going to go to press early next week. I think Monday or Tuesday will go to the printer. Should be out by the end of next week. So look for those in your mailboxes. Um, quick updates. Uh, the realtors, uh, we put an ad in the newsletter, did an email blast yesterday. If you're a realtor on the northeast side or north side of town, uh, you can be listed for free in our realtor directory. It's going to come out in June. It'll first appear in Carmel and in Geist um, right after that. Just go to townpost.com, click on the Realtors link, and submit your information. Um, if you put your information in, it's free. You can also buy ads, of course. But uh, it's going to go in both magazines, this one issue only. So if you're a realtor and you buy an ad in that June issue of Geist and Carmel, you only pay one price to get in both magazines, which is a one-time deal. We're not going to do this ever again. So uh, if you ever wanted to advertise with us, just give it a try. This is your one chance to do it and just pay the one price. And just give you an example, a business card ad is like 200 bucks, but for $200 you get in both publications, about 30,000 distribution, um, so that's not bad to be in that issue. So do that if you're a realtor. Uh, Geist Half Marathon, we're just three weeks away from the Geist Half. Uh, we need half registrations. Uh, the 5K is going along pretty well. We're going to keep that open for a while. The half marathon we need, uh, we're, we're actually down from last year, so we need to get that number back up. Um, we're hoping for a nice strong push between now and uh, May 19th. Um, if you want your name on the bib for this year, you need to register before May 1st because that's when the price increase goes in effect. And from that point forward, you can still register for the race. You're just going to pay $10 more than you will if you register today. But you won't have your name on your bib. It'll just be um, it'll be a bib number. It'll still have your time, but it won't have your name on the bib. So register this weekend. Get it over with. Sign up now. You'll save ten dollars just by registering before May first. That's when the price increase goes in. And uh, try to get all your friends to sign up as well. So it's hopefully it will be nice weather between uh, between now and then. You guys can get out and train a little bit. Five K is going on very well. We've got. Um, I think about 2,800, 2,700 people signed up for that so far, so uh, please come out and join us. May 19th, don't miss it. Also, a quick shout out for some volunteers. Uh, we need some more course marshals. We've got all the water stops covered, we've got all the uh, those things kind of covered, but the course marshals are the thing we always look for at the last minute. Um, if you live in the area, you live along the route, and you would, wouldn't mind putting on a vest and helping us with some traffic at some of those secondary and tertiary intersections, we'd really appreciate some help. So to do that, just go to geisthalf.com, click on the volunteers link, and you can actually go and register as a volunteer and select what you can do to help us. So I appreciate that. And last but not least today, the uh, the big news this week, Castlers is going to host a Carb Up at Castlers event the night before our race. So on May 18th, so Friday night, uh, a packet pickup. Here goes my neighbor. Um, May 18th, the night of our packet pickup, they're going to host a big party, uh, grab and go pasta. Um, stop by. They're going to have a band that night. They're going to have food specials for people running the guys' taff, uh, 5K. So um, have a pasta party at Castlers on the 18th, and then if you're um, if you're actually going to the race. Um, stop in. They're going to have a breakfast thing going on that morning. They're right there at the start line, so you can't miss Caspers. Uh, they're going to have something going on that morning, and then if you come by after the race, have lunch specials and things. Bring your medals with you to show you ran the race, and they're going to have some specials for you. So here I am in my garage, as cluttered as it might be. Um, I'm tuning out, going upstairs to get to work. Have a good day, everybody.